seven levels of revenue. Mm -hmm. Trust me, this is the real deal. Wisdom, number one. Seven levels of revenue. Wisdom, number one. Someone taught it to me. Vision, number two. Don't think you can bypass none of them. I tried it. Doesn't work. I took one for the team already. Don't do it. Number three, information and knowledge. Seven levels of revenue. Relationships. That's called relational capital. You don't go too far without it. A good name. If I can't trust you, I ain't buying nothing from you. And if I don't like you, I sure won't refer you. If I think you lie all the time, I'm fooling with you. And if you're not reliable, I'm never calling you. That's where the money is, ladies and gents. Property. You don't own nothing. You don't have nothing. Cash. Show me the money, honey. Cash, seven powerful levels of revenue. You ask any millionaire, billionaire, and I promise you they will reveal it to you. They may not use the same words, but they're going to share with you, this is how I built my wealth. I didn't make this up. This didn't come from my brain. I learned this. You know how I learned this is when I made the investment into myself to go and get the knowledge. And this is when I sat there and I paid money to learn it. And it was taught to me. And I took hold of it. And it wasn't until I applied each of the methods that I realized, oh my God, this is for real. For real. Wisdom, vision, information, which is knowledge. Okay? Relationships, a good name, property, and cash. If you are broke all the time, stop, take a look at what you're doing, and make a change. Stop spending, start saving, start investing, because if you don't invest, you can't get a return. Real estate man, okay? You don't invest, you don't get a return. Is that right? That's right. Y'all want to grow? Meditate on this. If you don't remember anything else I said today besides that mean old lady that came up with a little nasty attitude. <laughs> and they talk about she loves somebody. I do. I'm telling you this because I love you guys. And I, I love small business owners. And I believe that we really are, and I know 100% that we are the driving force of this economy. There is no good reason that we need to accept anything less than excellence. Period. Period. To be an extraordinaire, you must become extraordinary. Okay? I love you guys. Love you too.